dragon fruits at growplants.org, also known as pitaya. Uh, this plant can grow in uh, dry tropic, subtropical, desert, or Mediterranean. I uh, prefer a uh, stable climate, but can survive a little bit uh, hot summer and cool winter. It's an actually a vine cactus, uh, but in order to enjoy the fruits, I would highly recommend maybe to grow it uh, lower, as maybe as a, just a sherb with trellising, like you grow a grapevine. This is how uh, it's easier. You can see here, it's just as a small grapevine, you, the, it's easier to control, and if you don't have uh, natural pollinators, hand pollination, it's something that uh, quite of important. The real uh, natural uh, pollinators are bats and specific ones. So probably if you read about it, it's you are not from the area. Uh, sorry, you listen to this video, you are not from the area, and you need hand pollination. So this is something that you should be aware. Some variety like the yellow one uh, with the spines are uh, can be self pollination. So it's quite of nice that you don't need to work hard. Its grow uh, hardiness zone will be from a uh, ten above, and it's very important that it won't be too much cold. And except this, it's prefer also a uh, half shade to full shade. Uh, there is major problem, especially in hot climate locations, that it's too much hot and uh, it burns the uh, cladods. And if it burns them, uh, it causes some problems and it's better without. Uh, I saw people color the cladod sometimes in white in order to prevent uh, sunburns. Except this, uh, it's a slow growing plant that requires small amount of water. It grows from 2 to 20 meter, but better keep it small, so it's been too... 6 to 60 feet but again keep it small you can plant it from the spring to the summer and the best way to start it's plant or just to cut cladod and let it heal itself like uh, one month for example after this you put it uh, in the soil and treat it the same as fully mature plant uh, it's important to have more than one uh, cultivar in order to increase uh, the pollination. Better to, when you do pollination, to do it from two kinds of cultivars. Uh, of course, there is uh, some cultivars that are fit better and are easier to pollinate with them, other cultivars. So you should choose. Uh, this is uh, something specifically most of them it's generic name so it's hard to remember all of them it's bloom from the spring to the summer and the fruits can be from the spring to the autumn uh, you can eat it raw to make juice gems and it's take two to five years in order to have fruits except this uh, i would say that it's quite of easy to grow but it's harder to get some fruits from this plant because uh, hand pollination and this is make it a little bit harder so that's all from growplants.org don't forget to subscribe visit our website and like this video i hope you enjoy